Hey guys, looking to build a granny flat or accessory unit on your property? Well, this is Sean Zangane bringing you tips and tricks on how to win in the San Diego real estate market. So today we have Permit Pro, Ian Scattergood, bringing us the down low on how to get a granny flat or accessory dwelling unit built on your property here in San Diego. Ian, thank you so much for being with us. I really you appreciate it. Um, you know, this has become a super popular topic here in San Diego with all the popularity of people wanting to rent out their places on Airbnb or VRBO, with people wanting to have guests come stay, but maybe not in their home, and just to have that ability of additional income on a property you already own. So tell us a little bit what an ADU is, and you know, what is that here in San Diego, and why is that important? Okay, so an ADU is an accessory dwelling unit. Simply put, it's a second rentable unit on a single family developed lot. Awesome. Okay, so tell us if someone wants to go down the steps of uh, getting an ADU built, what are some basic rules or configurations that uh, are the rules here in San Diego so they can qualify and see maybe if their property is a right fit? Okay, so the state says the minimum size is 150 square foot. It does have to have at least a kitchenette and a three-quarter bath. So there's bathing facilities and cooking facilities. The maximum size is 1,200 square foot, and each jurisdiction can have either more restrictive or less uh, restrictive guidelines than what the state had put out. Okay, awesome. So, you know, it sounds like you could get almost a two or three bed place on a property like that, which is pretty cool. Now, yep. let's say I have the property, I wanna get started, who do I call? What do I do? You're the permit pro, so it seems like you're the guy who could help take this to the next step forward. Tell us a little bit what that looks like and what that process looks like, and how long would it take for someone to think about the idea and get it approved with the city? Awesome. So when people call my phone number, I have somebody answering the phone. They're asking for the site address where they want to put it. Give me that because before I even call you back, I'm going to Google it, look at it to see if it's a prime candidate to move forward. I sure. won't waste their time or my time. And then I can say, based on which jurisdiction you're in, okay. hey, here's your guidelines, here's your max, here's your minimum. Let's go forward. Okay, awesome. Now, a lot of people here in San Diego might have a secondary one-car garage or a secondary unit that maybe they used as a craft room that they want to convert into livable space here in San Diego, and they want to do it right, and they want to be legit. What is the process of someone taking an existing structure, which is very common that I see on a lot of properties we go to, and making it a, a, a legit rentable or livable unit? Okay, perfect. So I spent a lot of time on Metro Real Estate Caravans, North Park, South Park, Kensington. They all came with detached garages back in the 1920s and 30s. Sure. What the state law says, where that structure sits, if it was legally permitted as something, a workshop, a granny flat, you know, mainly it's a garage or carriage house. Where it sits today, I can make it like for the fire life safety codes. Sure. This is 150 square foot. I can now make that a unit where I didn't get credit for tandem parking before in that long driveway. Now I can. Okay. So this law gave me relaxed setbacks and off street parking guidelines. Okay. Very cool. Well, I know this has been a super popular topic in San Diego. And we really appreciate you coming out and, uh, giving us this information. Again, if you guys want to contact Ian to see if your property would qualify for that, click the link below and it'll take you to more information about him. Again, this is Sean Zangana here with Keller Williams and Ian Scattergood of the Permit Pro Consultants, bringing you tips and tricks on how to win in the San Diego real estate market. Thank you so much for being here, Ian. Thank you, Sean. Have a great day, guys.